person I fantasize a lot. I live in my mind, you know, we're creatives. We live in our mind, we create whole worlds. Like I have a whole nother life in my head. This time my whole nother life was with a man. So I wrote this, well not yet, we were about to be together, okay? I wrote this song about this guy and I had been fantasizing him so much in my head. Like I, would, I was so tapped into him. His mother had just died, my mother had just died. I was listening to his music constantly. Like his, his album, Stillmatic and Godson was just so freaking amazing. And then my, my friend, my producer gives me this track with this um, Ahmad Jamal piano sample that was on a track of his called One on One. Destiny, it was Destiny. We were going to be together. So I decided, this is the same track that my children's father changed the drums on. He changed the drums to like these really, you'll hear them in just a second. He changed his drums, so wonderful. And I decided to write this song. It was like my open letter to Nas. I really wanted to be his girl so bad, you got Like, I thought that I was going to sing this song. I was going to do a video. I was going to look beautiful. And he was going to be beating down my door to marry me. Like, no, y'all think I'm playing. I was so serious. Like, I thought that if I wrote this song, he would marry me, cause he would see like she's pretty and she can sing. I don't want him no more. But this is, who, this is who the song was about and I never told anyone, I would always tell the story that I wrote this about a guy, cause I just, you know, you don't want to sing like a stalker. Cause I really did stalk him in my mind, you know, but it didn't pan out, he got married. And he's divorced now, but it's too late. He should've chose me first. Anyway, this is how it goes. Baby. One, two, 